TikTok streamers, here's how to quickly set up Tickfinity in 2025. Download the Tickfinity desktop app, which is on screen. That's for Windows. If you're on Mac, just use the website. On the setup page, add your username and also click TikTok login and login to TikTok. Click on the actions and events page and either click yes on the pop-up or if you don't see the pop-up, it's this red box here, which you click to import. And this quickly imports some predefined actions and events. Then just click this blue link to copy it. Inside Live Studio OBS or Streamlabs, press the Add Source button. For Live Studio, this is called a link source. For OBS or Streamlabs, it's called a browser source and press Add. Control V to paste it into the box. Choose a custom resolution. For the predefined alerts, I like 500 by 300. Turn on sound and press Add Source. Right click, rename it to Tickfinity Screen 1 and click on it again on the left and it should be highlighted here on your canvas. What I'm going to do is drag it to the left and then drag the bottom right square until it's full screen and you can drag it to center it if you wish. And finally, we're going to head back into Tickfinity to test it on the actions and events page. We're going to scroll down the actions and events page and firstly, just increase this queue number on screen one to a thousand or something high. And then let's continue scrolling down the page to the simulator and you can press all of the simulate buttons to test it. Note that Live Studio bugs out sometimes you might have to close and reopen live studio anyway let's simulate a follow and click back into live studio and you can see it's now successfully working there is a way longer in-depth guide either below or in my bio